Let's add Impact XT to our song and let's just choose this acoustic kit preset. What happens is that Studio One creates one instrument track and connects it to Impact XT. But Impact XT shows up with five channels in the mixer. And this totally makes sense because in Impact XT we have a couple of different sounds like bass drum, different snares, hi-hat, toms and so on. So Impact sends these different sounds to different channels in our mixer, which is great because we can edit, for example, the bass drum or the snare drum differently with different volumes and different effects. So that's why we have one track for this instrument, but several mixer channels. We also call these multi-outputs because these are multiple signals coming out of the instrument. And you can actually change the number of outputs of a certain instrument simply by going into the instrument window and use this button in the toolbar called Outputs. Here you can see how many outputs are currently enabled for this instrument. And as you might guess, when I uncheck these outputs, the channels disappear from the mixer. Or you can also add more outputs if you want. For example, if you want each pad to have its own output. Or you only want one output for the instrument because you don't need all the other outputs, then you can just deactivate them here. The same can be done from the mixer as well. When you click the instrument, then you get the same list of outputs here and you can add or remove channels for this instrument. But what happens if you deactivate these outputs and then hit some of those pads like the snare? We don't hear it anymore because the pad is still routed to the second output which we have just turned off. So in this case we have to make sure that the instrument only uses the first output. Like in this case the pads in Impact XT where you can set the output for every single pad. This little 3 here means that this closed hi-hat is sent to output number 3. So we need to set it to output number 1. And now we get the hi-hat on our instrument channel. And this might work similarly in other instruments like addictive drums or easy drummer or contact or other drum instruments. Please hit the like button and if you want to support my YouTube channel, please subscribe. I really appreciate it. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.